I shouldn't say that. <laughs> we got Zane here getting ready to go, and he's going to get his morning bath and stuff. So we're going to get him all stripped down by the little man. Smell like somebody made a stinky. Ooh, we. We didn't put these socks back on you today, though, buddy. <laughs> I only got like one pair of socks for boys. I don't know. I really, really been like, I don't know, buying socks, I guess. Because I think babies are cute with no socks on. Some babies are cute with socks on. Like the little tiny little preemies. They're so adorable with socks. Okay, so let's get, oh, he's been great to get a bath. So we're going to put him in his little ducky, his little ducky robe. I got this from Mommy and Katis from my little box that she gave me when I gave her her baby. Um, so this came from her. This is so cute. I think my my daughter had a towel that was a duck. I never actually got like a robe or anything. I think my son had one, but I think he was like a little frog. I wish I would have kept all his baby stuff, but my mother-in-law wanted all his baby clothes back. I wish I would have kept them. And then I wouldn't be, the boys would have like so much clothes. It'd be ridiculous. <laughs> Oh, look at his little naked self. Put him get ready and to put him, get ready to give him a little bath. All right, be warned. He does have boy parts. So if you're offended with boy parts, you probably want to close your eyes on this part. Or, yeah, just close your eyes on this part. <laughs> but, ooh, we have a stinky. Yes, he. We got a stinky booty, stinky booty. Um, yeah, so let's change that. I'm gonna give you a bath and you decide you wanna poop and I'm not over there. All right, so we're gonna get this off of you, Mr. Man. Eww. Nasty. I don't think I can really see his little stinky poop. But ew, Mr. Man. You're just a little poop person. Okay, come on. Let's get this off your little tissue. Ew, mister. Sorry, guys. But somebody decided they want to take a poop before diaper time. That's okay. That is alright. We got it. Okay. Alright. Him's all fresh. Just wipe him off one more time. And stuff. Let's get you all good and good and fresh down here before we go get a bath. We don't want little duty turds. <laughs> in your tub okay so we're gonna just ball this little thing up here and yeah so we're gonna go ahead and put his little rub on before he decides he wants to take a pee pee we don't need pee pees but yeah so he's gonna go get a bath and we'll be back after his little bath I want to tie it because it's so adorable. Oh, look at him. All right, so he's ready for his little bath. So we're going to go and do that. And I will see you guys um, after that. Yes, I'll be back. All righty, here he is. He just got done getting his little bath. He love taking baths. He really do. So we got that taken care of. And now he's getting ready. We're ready to take him out and um, I'm trying to cover up his little boy parts. <laughs> get ready to take him out and get ready to put some clothes on him, his little diaper, some clothes, and feed him and stuff. So, yeah, we we'll see you guys back in in the in the room. Okay, get back, guys. Bottle here because we're gonna feed him this morning. Um, got his diaper for her before he starts to pee. And he's going to wear this cute little outfit. This came from his auntie Kate. It's, um, his little shark shirt says, surf, let me see if I can see it. Surf up, little dude. This, this says on the shirt. 
mixed up with this cute little um, bluish green or green shorts. And it came with these shoes. So that's what he's going to be wearing today. And then he's going to put some more socks on. So the shoes going to stay on his feet. Because he got like some tiny little skinny little feet. So we're going to go ahead and go ahead and get him out of this towel. He's all dry. I put a pest fire in his mouth because he was having a fit because he was cold. So yeah, pest fire back in his mouth. He's still a little wet. Gonna dry you off some more. No little big noggin. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna leave him on this little, this little thing, Jiggy. But um, big. He do have doll parts, as I warned earlier. Um, I try to hide him as much as possible, but it's a freaking doll. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry. I know mean, some people are very sensitive. They're like, I don't get it. It's a body part. Um, there are a lot of sensitive people out there. So we're gonna go ahead and put his diaper on real quick. Put your little hand on my sir. So he got his little diapers. Put it under his little belly button now. Right, there we go. His little diaper on. Okay, he is so adorable. That's why I love full leg babies. Okay, so let's go ahead and get him dressed. Uh, I'll probably should get him dressed first, then feed him. So I'm gonna get him dressed first. But yeah, this is our little morning little thing. He got his morning bath. Um, he's gonna get his morning feeding. And then um, we'll come back. And I'll do probably like an afternoon feeding with him as well, too. And make sure he's not. And then we'll change his little tissue and stuff. But yeah, so. Well, the plan was to go to the mall today. That's not happening. Not today. I'm hopefully get to go tomorrow. Um, I really won't finish up this school shopping, but I didn't get. Um, it didn't happen today. So, but that's not. Okay. I knocked this pest fire out of his mouth. Mommy, sorry. Just trying to get your little clothes on. Let's give you a passy bag. That's his favorite one. I gotta buy him some more little passies and stuff. Yeah, other ones, but I like the nook pest bars on him. The nooks and then like the wild, the big wild ones, they look so adorable on him. So, yeah. He's a cute just with this on alone. This is zero to three months. The shorts fit him, but the ones are a little big. His shirt's a little big, but it's okay. Um, I kind of like my boy's clothes to be somewhat big. Now, my girl clothes, I don't like their clothes to be too big unless it's a sleeper. Their sleepers can be big, but I like everything else to, to fit them. Okay, so let's move you off of this now because you're dressed. He is so cute. Put your little socks on your feet and then your shoes on. So here you go. Here are your little socks on. Oh, I've got a couple more nails. I'm actually going to paint my nails today. I'm in a nail painting mood. I have to finish putting all the rest of these baby clothes up. But I'm in a bit of finger nail painting mood. Actually, I'm going to actually start on um, this little kit today. Um, finish, start on um, something I should have done weeks and weeks ago. But you know, like when your workspace is like not clean and stuff, and you just don't feel like the nerve to be in that space. I've been like that. That's why I really haven't really been recording. Um, I just. My space was so negative. Um, I hated it. I hate like a messy place, or whatever. Like I gotta go straighten up my kitchen because my husband decided to cook some rice and stuff, and he didn't cook right. It was too hard, and he tried to make it soft, and it just didn't do anything. And then I think he kind of burnt it, and he just left the. Why do men always cook the leave dishes? Like you cooked it, clean it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But I gotta go clean. His mess, what he done um, last night and stuff in the kitchen. Um, I didn't even eat dinner last night. 
I have not been hungry. I wasn't hungry or anything like that. But I know today I'm going to do my tea and um, apple cider vinegar. I probably recorded and stuff too. I don't, I don't know. But we're going to go ahead and feed his little bit. But like I was saying, um, yeah, it's so much negativity. That's why I've been in my daughter's room because her room is clean and it's just oh, so relaxing to be somewhere where it's clean. And like, now that I got my room clean and together, it's not totally together, but it's together. Um, and I have like a recording spot over here on, on this little bed thing. I just got to get like a mattress right now. We just sent, it just is a mattress, but I'm going to get like a higher mattress, whatever. And um, so, and yeah, and since it's clean, my workspace is clean. Um, I'm in like a painting mood. So I'm going to start on um, Xander. Because remember I took Xander apart. So I'm going to start on him and stuff. I'm going to make some stuff. I'm going to start on him and stuff, so, yeah, and all of that, and, um, I'm trying not to be in camera, but it's kind of hard, <laughs> it's really kind of hard, I'm trying not to be in camera, but it's okay, um, but, so yeah. I forgot what I was in town. Oh yeah, I'm going to start painting. I am going to record me painting them, painting on them and stuff. Um, I probably do that after I finish feeding him and get him down for his morning nap. Um, and then yeah, so then we'll come back with him with his afternoon one. So he's going to be on camera all day today. It's going to be Mr. Zane today, all about Zane. So. Yeah. And um I think that's pretty much it. I think he's about done. I think. But yeah, so um just getting on my hand. Whew, I don't know. I think he's not I think he's a he's a hungry boy today. Someone is hungry. But yeah, so he is so cute in his little outfit. I'm sure you guys can be outfit once he's done eating and stuff. I put him, I set him up where I can see him. But he's starting to fall asleep, so, and he's slowing down on his bottle. So, yeah, we're gonna take him away slowly. We're gonna place him with the pacifier. That's how we do that one. <laughs> we replace it. I need to find another one of these, but I'm find like the smaller ones. I think it'd be cute with a smaller one. All right, come on. Let's show show your aunties your outfit for today. So there he is in his little outfit with his little shoes. He's so adorable. But he's falling asleep, so we're going to let him go to sleep and stuff. Itchy. I'm going to get him ready for bed. Didn't get to do the afternoon. Stop. No. Come over here. Over here. Go play with. Get the monster. No. Okay. All right. I didn't get to do the um afternoon cleaning. I went to my my sister's house, so I didn't do that. But we are gonna get him ready for bed. So we're gonna get him out of this cute little thing and get him ready for nighttime. So I got him diaper for the night. And then he's gonna wear these pajamas. But you wore this before if they really cute on him, so I'm going on. And then he's gonna get fed from the bottle, nighttime bottle. So, let's get into it. Yeah, but I went to my sister's today. Chill with her for some hours and stuff. Um, so, yeah. It's very rare I go to her. She up here. So, do you want me to get to Mamie? Oh, no, she's fine. She's just looking at stuff. You want to go with Uncle P? 
No, not since it's been clean. <laughs> okay, so. Nope, air don't come in here the way it goes. <laughs> okay. But yeah, but I worked out today. I worked out early this morning. Basically, I just walked my dog. But it's kind of like working out because I walk longer distance with him now. So um, I worked out this morning and then I worked out around like I got back home from my sister's. I think around like 5.30. And then I worked out again and stuff. Ooh. And now I'm finna um, stop. I'm finna go back to doing the my tea and apple cider vinegar. I'm nervous because last time I drank tea, it didn't work. I think it was just the detox tea that I did. I don't think my body, the stuff that's in detox tea, um, is is I don't know something in it that my body don't like and cannot take, and I was getting sick. So I'm not I won't do the detox tea. I'm just gonna do some regular um, regular tea. And then with the um, apple cider vinegar in it. Because I can't do honey. Like just put like just putting this adding like per honey into my foods or anything. I can't do that without getting sick. My, I think I'm a, I don't, I don't know what it is. But every time I eat honey, I always end up um, throwing up the honey and stuff. So y'all yeah, can even see his little boy parts. Because I got the camera, so that's good. But yeah, so... We won't do the honey in my tea. So we're just gonna do the apple cider vinegar and tea and a little bit of sugar to take some of the um the tartness out of the, the vinegar so I can drink it better without I feel like I'm about to I'm about to gag and throw up. So yeah. Just a little bit of sugar, not too much, just a little bit. Come I'm doing this type of way. Oh, and I was at the dollar store today and I was talking, I was talking about losing weight and stuff. Um, cause I got something. Oh, cause I got my worker clothes on. He had to just about to go to the gym. I'm like, no, nah, I just left. That's said, I just left from working out. He's like, oh. And then he mentioned water pills and the dollar store sells some. I think it's like $4, about like $5 with the tax would be from like five something. And he told me about water pills. He said he want to take, I think he said take eight pills out through the day. Um, you take two in the morning, and then you take, I think, but okay, he said take about eight pills during the day. And also in that process, um, drink plenty of water as you're doing it because, um, if you don't drink any water, the water pill will like. Uh, he said something about some about your saliva and stuff. You got like a mouthful of saliva and all that crap because you know you putting all this water and stuff in your body, but you also peeing it out at the same time, and you gotta replace that water with some water. So uh, he told me about that. Um, I drink water every day anyway, so it won't be a problem. I don't have to worry about my saliva being all built up in my mouth. I don't gotta worry about that because it's disgusting. And I'm sorry, it's just here. It's nasty. And when I brush my teeth, if I take my bird, my toothbrush out of my mouth, I'm going to have to um, wash it off <laughs> and put a new toothpaste on it and brush my teeth again. Because, yeah, cause I can't do it. I just can't. It's nasty to me. And, um, so, I'm going to go back and get the, um, the water pills later. In life, I don't think I. I'm so super hot. I don't really think I need it um, at this right now. Right now, I'm just walking and stuff, whatever. Cause like I can pee where I live. I live outside of college, and it has like um, I live like I can literally go in my back or actually from my window. I can watch the football game. 
from my window, basically. It's pretty cool. And, um, so, yeah. And I'm looking for a workout partner. I was going to be working out with my cousin Amanda because she lives up here. And we're supposed to be working out together, but it's kind of hard because, you know, she got kids and I got, I got kids. And I would like to work out with without <laughs> the kids because we'd probably have to like, go somewhere with a park and then go play at a park while we go walk and stuff, whatever. Um, but I think it would be something cool because they can get to play with their cousins and stuff. So I'm um, call probably text her and see what she likes to so see if she gets to work out next weekend. We can probably work out together next weekend. And stuff like that. I'm serious about getting to my goal in December. I want to be probably like, if I can't even get to 250, I want to be in the hundreds by December. You only have to be like 150. Um, I just want to be somewhere near the hundreds. It can be like 185 um, by December. I want to be in the hundreds. I think that'd be really awesome and it'd be like a really good goal for me. That's one of my goals um, for that, for, for now. So I'm starting all over. So I got these Bigger Losers DVDs. My husband got me these long ago. We was this boyfriend and girlfriend when he got me those. And um, I only done them like one time <laughs> since he bought them. And then I got Zumba. So I might find my Zumba. I need to find it. Um, I don't know where it's at. I really don't. But once I find my Zumba, I can do Zumba again and stuff, whatever, like that. But yeah. Sorry. Oh, you don't even use bottles no more. So. He's about to anyway. So, yeah. Can he finish? He done? No. He gonna take another bottle to put it in your mouth. You just mess with yourself. I don't know what I'm gonna do with you. But yeah. So. I was gonna do these videos separately. So I gotta go in and edit it and I'm just gonna put them all together. But I didn't get to do his afternoon feeding and stuff. Like, I want to do like a whole day with him, but I decided to go cheer up my sister and all of that stuff. And I'll put me going over there because I needed to print off a, um, a pattern to make a baby head. And I didn't even do it. We got to talking and stuff like that about things. And it never um, it never happened on me printing this off. So I'm kind of... Thank you, but I don't need it no more. But thank you. I'm just leave it right there beside him. How about that? Yeah. Oh, you, you. I don't think he needs it no more. Uh, per think he's. He, yeah. He don't want it. He could. He did. He's gonna put that. Stop touching stuff. Jeez, girl. Jeez, Louise. Bless you. But yeah, so he is ready for bed and stuff. And, um, so yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. I feel like I found some of Paulie's. Stop it. I got some of Paulie's sleepers that I got. I was going to put those. I haven't even put them up yet. Put it back. Thank you. Go to your Uncle P. Where's your Uncle P at? Pierce, you still in here? Pierce! Huh? Come get your baby! <laughs> but yeah, so. See y'all go. Nothing. She. I think she's nothing. She's playing in the hallway. Yeah. But yeah. So didn't get to do the afternoon, the afternoon feeding, but it's okay. I still got to see him all today, yeah. twice today. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, you know. Yeah. 
I record all the all the time. I do like to chill with my sister or something because they're gonna be moving. I don't know when, but I will be start back back babysitting them. Um, starting next month until they move. And yeah, so I want to end it here. May May, I'm coming. So I'm gonna end it, and I will see y'all guys tomorrow. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video so our family can grow. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I probably do a whole a whole morning morning routine and routine with another baby. I kind of like doing this, so I do it with another baby. And I will see you guys um, tomorrow. Peace out.